video deals with the discovery of electrons a very important discovery in the history of mankind so let's start the video students first of all let's see the discovery of atom in 1808 dalton gave his atomic theory that atoms are simple compact bodies so it was a daltonian concept that atoms they are simple compact bodies and he didn't know that it consists of some discrete particles as well as the century progressed discoveries by scientists modified the daltonian concept in 1887 jj thomson a scientist came and he identified electrons in cathode ray tube which is electric discharge tube let's see what this is in the electric discharge tube or gas discharge tube two metallic electrodes which are cathode and anode are present it is filled with gas at desired pressure electrodes are connected to high voltage source and to a vacuum pump this is the discharge tube as you can see this is the tube it's a cathode which is negatively charged electrode this is anode which is positively charged electrode gas is present at very low pressure these are the cathode rays which i'm going to explain in in the next part of the video this is the vacuum pump and this is the high voltage generator so this is the simple composition of discharge tube a gas discharge tube now what happens is the working is like electric current was passed at ordinary pressure gas in the tube was not affected even at 5000 volts gas was then discharged at low pressure of about 0.01 torr and given 5000 to 10000 volts now let's see what happened it was observed that the screen behind the anode started to emit light as it was coated with some fluorescent material so it was said that rays originate from cathode so the same cathode ray tube is also present in your television screens too and produces images as the screen is coated with the fluorescent material so in the television the images that you see is also because of this cathode ray tube now let's see the properties of cathode rays and how did jj thomson determine that these are electrons the first property is when you applied a magnet the rays are deflected by a magnet in the direction expected for negatively charged particles so jj thomson noticed that these particles are somewhat negatively charged particles like you can see in the diagram this is the magnetic field and this is the deflection and this showed somehow that according to physics that these cathode rays are negatively charged particles and the second property was in an electric field the rays are deflected towards the positive terminal that is the anode showing the negative nature so again in the magnetic field and in the electric field the rays were deflected in a manner that it showed their negative nature as you can see in the diagram this was a positive plate this was a negative plate and these these were the rays and these were deflected towards the anode that is the positively charged terminal so you can say opposite attracts positive attracts negative and negative attracts positive so these rays were attracted toward the positive terminal that is the positive plate so it showed the negative nature so the cathode rays were negatively charged particles another scientist hit off proved that rays cast a sharp shadow when opaque object is placed in their path showing they travel in straight line perpendicular to the cathode so they cast a sharp shadow like you can see in the diagram this is the cathode this is the anode and this is a metal cross and you can see it casted a shadow so it showed that the rays travel in a straight path cathode rays can drive a small pedal wheel in their path showing that they are material particles and they have some sort of momentum the rays they can ionize gas and are capable of penetration in metallic sheets like aluminum and gold so this is another property of these rays they, they can ionize gas so whatever the gases in the discharge tube the cathode rays that is electrons were always the same this proved that electrons are the fundamental particles of all atoms so this was how electrons were discovered by jj thomson i hope this video was helpful if you like this video please like share comment and subscribe
Thanks for watching. Wish you all the best.